Hey, Halloween is going to look a lot different this year, as you might imagine. According to a survey from Apartment Guide, nearly half of those surveyed said they don't plan to pass out candy. While it may be disappointing for the kids to skip traditional trick-or-treating, the managing editor for Apartment Guide told our Erica Greenway there are ways you can make it a fun night while still staying safe. There's still lots of Halloween activities that don't involve going and get candy. I know that's not as fun, but you could really do a scavenger hunt in your yard for your kids and hide candy at the end. A lot of people do things like this for Christmas or Easter or other things if there's gifts involved or birthdays where it's kind of a game. There are clues that you need to follow to really go and try to find the prize at the end. It's a great way to keep kids entertained that's more than just you know going and giving them candy. Yeah, we posted a link to clues that you can print out on WDKR.com. Another idea they suggest, play bingo where each square on the card is a costume that you see someone wearing. Your neighborhood could also hold drive-by trick-or-treating where people toss candy to kids lined up on the street, almost like a parade. Or you could hold a virtual costume contest through Zoom. That's right. Let's make it fun.